Around the world, at any given moment, 2,000 thunderstorms are churning through the sky, producing up to 100 flashes of lightning every second. Lightning might seem like something we've got all figured out, but in fact, the details of the physics behind those flashes is still a bit of a mystery. Los Alamos National Laboratory studies lightning because it produces signals similar to those from a nuclear explosion. That understanding is helping us develop better instruments for nuclear test ban treaty monitoring and, in the process, allowing us to answer a lot of questions about lightning itself. For example, what initiates lightning? Some say it's caused by cosmic rays scattering enough electrons through the atmosphere to get a current going. But recent research conducted by Los Alamos scientists and their collaborators strongly suggests that lightning actually arises from areas of extremely high, localized electric fields, not from the long paths that a cosmic ray-induced event would require. We're also learning that lightning can be a useful tool. Research shows that enhanced lightning rates can indicate severe weather. Maybe someday our understanding of lightning will allow us to use space-based lightning detection to predict tornadoes and other severe weather events with enough lead time to prevent casualties. Until then, Los Alamos will keep studying and better understanding those mysterious energetic streaks in the sky.